Hello and welcome to another set of turns of Dominions 5. I am the False God. Joining me is Arpatheus. Hello. Hello. We are on turn 65. No messages. Do we have more? Oh, I was going to say more horrors taking out uh, <laughs> our immortals, but no, not this time. Yeah, they were never going to never gonna do anything. Inside. How did Caleb lose a Harab here? Is he just gonna get shot by an arrow? Uh, <laughs> please tell me yes. I it has to be. Oh, uh, did he get the snipe? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's guys in robes. Guys in robes. Oh, nine HP. Oh, <laughs> well, he just wore a crown. And he goes naked about that. That's crazy. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, yeah, Dione getting it done. Well, I haven't watched the whole fight, but. That is a lot of gems are worth of quartz corpse constructs that get wiped out by this. Yeah, it's not that many at this stage though. Like the, how I mean, how true. you can get them. True. It's not it's not an insane number, but still It's a number though. It is a number. A white mage takes out a Wraith Lord underwater. Just to boots the messenger. This guy's got some gems and Thistle Mace, and he's going to do Water Elementals with this Thistle Mace. And these guys do not help Soul Vortex. No, and the armor piercing is pretty good. And there's Swarm. A Swarm, actually, I think, if he wasn't careful, could have uh, turned this the other way. Because I think you can leech off Swarm, yeah. right? Uh, well, yeah, they're just animals, so yeah. Yeah. I don't know if he would have won still, um, but could have done. Could have done. Uh, okay, we've got the cubes, cubes and a Dione and some Shugo against PD a and a lot of elementals. And a lumber construct. Yeah. Oh, he's not even got here. Yeah. Oh, we got Wailing Winds, we got okay. Firestorm, we got Ravenous Swarm. Oh, everything's happening. Air elementals against cubes. Never seen that before. It's Firestorm is on Yomi's side. The others are on Kalem's side. Yeah. Has Kalem got fire resistance? Uh, I'm going to go with probably no. The number of people on fire, I'm going to say no. No, that's, that's not great. Yeah, that's probably not where he wanted to be. Summon Earth Power. So he did Firestorm first, then summon Earth Power. So that's a lot of reinvigoration. Um, that he could have had if he'd done that one first, because I think he. Kind of uh, I think out. I think getting I think getting it that extra turn though. Yeah, I mean getting nice. it up's nice. I mean, yeah, he just he just burned them all, but Yomi routed. Okay, but there's a they won. But yeah, um, he lost one, only Shugo and only Shiro and Unfrozen. Gonna run, but then wins. <laughs> yeah. He lost. He lost everything here except one summer lion, one that little pyromancer, yeah, like and he killed, Like ten plus mages. The black rose sorceress is slow to recruit as well. Yeah. Yeah. And all those gems. I think it was pretty. That was pretty nice. Yeah, I think that was worth it. That didn't work. That is a big mummy. Mm -hmm. Wraith Lord gets it done. Robs. Okay. So, looks like they've reasserted themselves up here for the most part. Still. Yeah. Oh where was God. that? Where was that actual battle? So many gems. This one is just against one PD. No, no. But where was that battle that we watched? Oh. Oh. Yes. Um. That was in the southern okay. oh, that... lands. Army continues to stay in the Kalem army. It did. I don't understand. It's gotta go it's and like fight somebody. It's like army, like it's there, but it's not doing anything. So is it really there? Yeah. Go, go, take 
Go all hit of some this stuff. crap. I mean, there's less stuff than there was before. There's 400 units. Yeah, there was there was 400. Well, it could just be a different. Uh, I say it could be a different scouting report. report. I guess. Yeah. Um, oh, the Black Rush Tower going over to Yomi. Yeah, he's got a die tank. I can't it? believe no one has built a fort on this. Yeah, I mean, it'd probably be like just worth summoning a fort. Mm -hmm. That's an amazing mage. Uh, if, if Omi, uh, Omi, if Yomi can get. Uh, <laughs> The uh, is it bloodlust or whatever, whatever the demon spell is that gives you. Oh, extra it's not bloodlust. That's enough. the one that only works on demons. It's um. No, but, but they are rush of strength. No, but they they can get bloodlust because they're. Oh they're sure, bloodlust. they do have a lot of demons. So, that's fair. So they could just cast that. Um, you don't need to put loads of research into it, and it's it's really nice. That's true. They have a lot of demons. Um, but yeah, Yomi, I think is ahead again. Maybe? I mean, Caleb's got a lot of victories, too. Let's, I guess let's... Provinces... Let's have a look at the graphs. Come on. Yomi, I guess... Okay, Yomi's down one, Caleb's up one. <laughs> right, but uh, since the start of the war, I mean, they're up, and they're definitely up yeah, in the last closing. sort of five turns, so... Yeah, yeah. You tie with him. Yeah, I mean, if you're Yomi and you show that to someone, I think, yeah. I think they could go and attack Caleb. Yeah. Probably going to have to be Hinnom, but... Probably. And Hinnom was thinking about it. Um, they've they've given up their elf uh, hatreds for the moment. I don't believe they've given them up forever, but... At least for now. Yeah, I mean, they, they don't they don't like uh, Kaelin, though, because they feel like Kaelin kind of betrayed them. Twice. A couple of times. So... <laughs> it's another one in the Book of Grudges. Yes. Revenant. Oh, it's only the evil demons of Yomi that they they've had a good relationship with. This this revenant, this death one revenant, doing animate skeleton. This is this, this is, is a this is what this is what efficiency looks like. Oh my god! It works like if your opponent's using one PD. I mean, yeah. And you want to use low commitment? Just use this guy. Yeah, I mean, I. He probably just got him to use as like a like a school yeah, mentor I mean, essentially, and then yeah. you know, he's getting this value as well. Right? Yeah, I mean, I that's tremendous. <laughs> that that is value. That's that's stonks right there. That's hilarious. yeah, yeah. If you don't like this, then you don't like you don't like value gameplay. You don't um, like efficiency. Yeah. Uh, it's a bit of a bigger fight. Sort of. It's piggies versus last march for this ball. Mm. Oh, we've got a running away dwarf. Hmm. And the commander get the commander gets sniped? No, I think yeah. I th they're all in one squad. I think they're just all right. <laughs> or did they are they on attack flyers? They're on attack uh, flyers. Okay. They get they get chopped up. There goes fifty three great boars. I uh, got four of in here. Yeah, I'd still, even then, not even like a terrible trade. Yeah, that's true. I mean, yeah, that's true. And yeah, there's Dwarven Smith. Um, Marverni takes out that. Okay, well, should we? I think we should have a look at that army, actually. Fair enough. We'll just wait until it fights something. That is a lot of druids. Yeah, that's pretty much exactly how I expected this army. Uh, God, can you imagine hitting this pile with. Like a gift from heaven or a flame yeah, from the sky. Yeah, or just like uh just like like some sort of fire spell like Yeah, yeah, flying fires. Like if you just walk up a bunch of mages and just flame eruption. Mm. Yeah, that's that's forty nine druids. <laughs> yeah, I just I don't think it's gonna take Vanheim very long to cut through that chaff. Nope. I don't And I they're don't... not even like they're not even positioned at the back. Uh, like in the middle. Yep. Yep. And I, yeah, I, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I think that was that your worried sound. <laughs> it is my worry. That was my worried sound. This is the big army. We'll have to see where those two yeah. are in relation to each other. Uh, I'm gonna say next to each other. Yeah. Okay. Well, so I mean, I mean, that was a, that was a, 
that was a big there's 30 big stargazers me. here yeah so that was what was in the province that van heim is currently in i think yes. they, they all just kind of dodged each other they did this one it looks this like is it looks 49. like he rode out as well so i i don't know why he hasn't moved his army from his cap into that province that Van yeah is in, to go and it fight because it. it was never going to move east like it, that that was the only other place it could have gone to this, um, this army pretty, i mean his army from his cap can like beat that army right like i Presumably I mean, I would think so, as long, with the right spell cast. Um, and this army's got no, it's cut off, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, I think that was, a, I think that was a real, if he thought he could win, you know, with those other two armies, which he, I mean, he moved them to try and catch. I'm not sure he actually necessarily could, but I think, you know, yeah. I think he could have definitely caught that. And if he'd have caught it, it would have all died. Yeah. Yeah. I, fighting that would pretty much win rounds. him the war, I think, you know, uh, unless... Yes. It would definitely I, give him an advantage for a lot of turns. Yes, I don't know that Banheim Banheim does not have another force this size. No. That's for sure. Um Alright, should we do the next turn? Yeah, I think I think we're definitely gonna see that soon. Right, let's go see. I want I want a big that's, fight. That's really what we live for. Yeah. We're here for the big fights. Message from Hinnom. We've been really struggling getting our dominion spread. We've been blood sacking from one to three strength from all our forts the last 15, 20 turns, and it's barely anywhere. Very sad. Let's see if that's true. <laughs> this is when he's at the top of the graph. So. <laughs> oh, it's, no, it's going I mean, up. It's I mean... true. It is It is going way up. So I, maybe he can't feel it, but it is going way up. Yeah, it's hard. Um, it's hard late game because your opponents have all their candles in. It's hard to, mm -hmm. to get rid of the candles once they're in place. Yes, uh, so this is a lot of this is probably just strengthening his own candles. But we've seen Hinnom rolling out mages on his borders, um, to or not mages, sorry, but priests on his borders just to preach, uh, as well. So he's treating yeah, he's trying he's treating Dominion very seriously. So I I expect this to continue going up. Oh yeah. I mean, Melkart sacrifice a huge number of slaves per turn. Yeah, I think his his income's pretty high at this point now. They they sacrifice four. Yeah, it's not you know it's it's a lot, but it's not. It's I not mean, gonna, like break the bank or anything. No, I well, I mean, yeah, I, he he can afford it, but um, I mean, he's got what one two. He's not at war three. right now. So. Four, five, six. I mean, so he has six temples, right? Which means that he could theoretically, if all those oh, he's, card... he's got his throne as well, and probably. Oh no, sure, but um, but each of those temples, right, can blood sack. Um, what did I say it was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, and the, and the throne. Yeah, and then the. Uh... And then TN, nine, and then, and then the other one above that as well. Ten, and each of the so he could he could have those ten, but he could also put out an extra forty temple checks if they all had a Melkart blood sacrificing. Yeah, he probably doesn't have a Melkart in all of them. Um, that although is I mean, true. he has a Citadel in his cap, but he it's gonna be a lot. I mean, that's a lot of Melkarts, but um, even if you have somebody lesser doing it, that's still potentially a lot of extra temple checks. And that's why he's going up so much in the Dongrath. Yeah. Just not enough for uh, his own. I guess, own yeah. That, it's, looks like a massive magic phase move out from Caleb here. I like that a lot. Is it? Well, hold on. I said magic phase. Yeah. These adventurers can't magic phase, right? What am I What am I missing? Were they already here? Are they, oh, they're stealthy. Okay, they, they popped out to fight. Although I'm not sure what they were doing, but... Seraphs. Okay, I'm um, not sure what they were like magic phasing on ooh. exactly there. Those looked like they were just taking the province, but this has an Onishugo Maybe and a Dione. Up oh, the Dione's on he retreat. Oh, oh, if he's just retreated into nothing. That'll be if, sad. The, if the other provinces got taken in the rest of the magic phase, that's going to hurt. Yep. And they're just doing uh, Mind Bird and Soul Slayer. Let's sensible, just... sensible choices. Yeah. 
Hey, oh, wait, I uh, enslaved mine too. He got the Onishugo. Nice. Let's check real quick. Um, okay, there are lots of retreat routes. Um, so that, uh, that... Yeah, there could have been some other battles in the normal phase afterwards, though. True. Okay, um, this one lost. I guess this Dione was not on retreat. No, is this just... Oh, this is Aerily. Okay. I don't know why he's using the Harab... I guess these are just the R2 randoms, though. Yeah. I mean, oh, look at the wolves. Oh, the, the wolves. oh my god, the oh wolves! Oh my god, the Holy god. Cow. absolute stone-cold killers, those two wolves. Oh my goodness. I guess god, he needs somebody on skeletons. That's... Wow. That's terrifying, that is. That is hilarious. Never say that those wolves <laughs> are useless. Oh, the Wraith Lords get sniped again. Has any, have you ever seen a game with more value gotten out of Send Lesser Horror? No, no, definitely not. They've killed so many Wraith Lords. He's doing it just like the one cast as well. Yeah. It's the one. I didn't even. We didn't even. I didn't even make it in time. <laughs> this he's is still. This is still Send Lesser, right? Yeah, he's less. He's literally a Lesser uh... Horror. They're a good counter. Yeah. Yeah. And then if they kill them, they get the horror marks. They'll they'll focus them more as well over the PD. That's right. Fight them again. Well, and they might get sniped by horrors when they come back. Uh, you don't even have to do anything. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Wraith Lord gets wiped by. I think I think using blood magic against death magic and vice versa is just quite a cool. I think that's I think that's that's quite a satisfying like. <laughs> thing for them to fight each other, I think. Yes. Hell sword and some stuff. And this guy is a hero <coughs> for like precision, not helpful, even a little bit. And he's doing Oh, where's the bow of war? Come on. <laughs> I think he's gonna no, die the same bow. way he did. There's no nothing to actually gain life off of. I don't know if you can gain life off the air relies. No, I don't think so. Enough, he, I mean, he much. isn't. Yeah. All right, there goes a the mummy. Um, F. F. F in the chat. Um. Oh, those adventurers. Uh, yeah, so can he... Can that die only if retreated into that province then? Yeah, probably. Dione, what, is Dione in retreat too? No? No. Oh, he didn't, oh. he didn't roll enough wolves, otherwise he definitely, they would have killed everything. Did he retreat? He must have. Did, was he have the ring of returning, is it that guy? Oh, uh, the ring of returning I he, thought was he, on he, a, he, um... He, he disappeared really fast. He did. Let's check it again. I thought the ring of returning was on the mummy. But you're right, he does have it. I, love you. I mean, this guy's heavily kitted, so you definitely don't want to lose him. Yeah. <laughs> so much back and forth. Is this... this is, is this the army? I think this is the army. It's got the Dione, so yeah. I'm yeah. pretty sure it is. 49 <laughs> Arab Sarabs, 16 Eagle Kings. <gasps> this is going to get Wind of Death. Uh, yeah, I mean, well, we'll see what it is. If it's on a <laughs> four, it can't, but I don't think it is. But there was a fort next to it, so it could be. It is yeah, on a fort. Yes. But, I mean, at some point, it's going to win to death. Overcome. Okay, so this felt... This turn felt better for Caleb. This felt much more proactive from Caleb. Yes. Which is good to see. It's good to see Caleb uh, getting in there. Oh, yeah, look at that. Much better. And that almost returned... Not quite, but almost returned Yomi to... Pre-war. Uh, yeah, I mean that's it's kind of been uh, 
the theme of Yami's game, hasn't it? Like, yeah, I mean, he gets uh... you know, something goes well, and then gets a reverse back to where he was at the start of the war, yeah. and then keeps going yeah. again. I finally got to uh, to to play with the Yomi player in one of our blitzes. It was fun. So shout out to Stone Troll. Um... Also, I I just like to point out how um, convoluted the the tracing of income is uh, for Caleb into the lands he's taking from Yomi. Although I guess he is getting it through that water, but otherwise he's got to go up there, then round underneath. <laughs> um, um, or... <laughs> he's getting yeah, through here too. Um, yeah, Stone Troll was played man and got to magic five. Oh, um, three. The dra- it's right, yeah, exactly. Everybody's like, what? Oh, even, even more horror map. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I again, I... Despite that, I I think that this is Caleb's to win if he if he asserts himself, and it seems like that is happening currently. Yeah, I just think I just think it's taking too long. I think he's going to get. I think Caleb's going to stab him, but. Uh, yeah, he's... Should, should we should we have a little look over? Um... He's also busy making a border for him to stab him. <laughs> that's, that's that's nice of him. <laughs> Uh, should we have a little look at Pelagia? No, we haven't talked oh, about Oh, yeah. That. All right. Yeah. Sorry, Pelagia. Yeah. Um, They're here. You are. They I have know, an army we know you're here. Side. Well, let's. That's the only thing that matters to Pelagia. It's. It's. They have to be at this point. Like, <laughs> there's, no, there's no way. Like, they, How many nines does Caleb have? Uh, I'm surprised Caleb hasn't, hasn't flatlined this, but like, hasn't got everything. Yeah. They really haven't. I mean, we. You know. How many mages did we see this turn? And they're still doing like it did. It did technically dip down slightly, but <laughs> yeah, technically. But yeah, I mean, I, I did. I did like that. Hinnom looks like they're researching uh... faster than uh, Pelagia as well now. Yeah, look at the, look at this. Look at Hin- Hinnom has been. Hinnom has just has just said, you know yeah, what? Research <laughs> is for other people. I'm gonna win the game without it. I don't think that was a, that was a. An intentional choice. That was a force. <laughs> hmm. Look at us go. Um, I, yeah, I mean, Pelagia, I think we have the same commentary we've had before, right? If he's if he's got a big wish engine going, then that's great. Yeah, there's, there's, I, I can't see any summon but troops. I don't see any evidence yet. But, which, I mean, he, sh- he could have it online by now. Yeah, he... he... I mean, I think he could have had it a while ago. If yeah. he wasn't, yeah, if he wasn't doing anything else, which we haven't really seen him do much, much else since he he, he kind of got pushed he, back by Vanheim. Yeah, he he tried to whack Vanheim a little bit. It was like, ooh, ah, he looked like he burned his hand on the stove. Like, ah, uh, I'm going back underwater. <laughs> I'm going back to my underwater cave, and I'm gonna stay there. Yeah. He's got oh, he's, he's, he's yeah, he's got his he's got his stuff uh, on that throne. He's yeah. Someone's someone's gonna have to fight him at some point for that. Are they? Yeah, I think I think so. I think Hanov can win the game without fighting Pelagia. Uh, I mean, maybe, but I think I yeah, I think I think you still just try and get that thrown. It's on your border. I don't think you're just not attacking Pelagia. Yeah. If you're trying to win the game. Yeah. I will point out, I think I was at one point questioning where Hinnom's Cohens were for blood hunting, but he's just not using them. We got four mail cards here blood hunting. <laughs> well, they're on the border for if you need them. Four mail cards blood hunting. I think he's decided that four is the magic that's number. The, that's the sweet spot. He's got, oh, the vampires. Vamp- yeah. Is this the first vampire we've seen? No, we, we saw that. Did we? Okay. It's yeah. been a long time. Vampires are, I mean, vampires are great for Hinnom. They're Certainly, much more efficient blood hunters, or at least much less destructive blood hunters. They're, I guess they're less efficient, but they don't. Yeah, yeah. They don't eat people. I feel shouldn't vampires probably have some kind of population killer, right? Like they do that. Yeah, that's actually. Yeah, they definitely should. If Hanam has to have population killing, then vampires yeah, so should, too. should. They should. Yeah, you should lose. Like it should be tied to the number of thralls they make or something. <laughs> yes. Um, okay. That was Pelagia. They're present. Uh, I apologize, yep, yep. Pelagia, that we don't have better commentary for you. <laughs> okay, well, I think we keep, 
They keep threatening to have a big fight between Malverni and Van Heim. Yeah, we, it might. We might be this turn. missing it. Well, I guess one honestly, I think I think Van Heim can win it, but I don't. You know, if if all those armies collapse on him, if he has to fight all of the Malverni stacks, then. Then I don't think he can. I mean, I'm just imagining all those Marverni guys showing up and just doing like hundreds of casts of gifts from heaven. Yeah, I mean, that, that is not many mages. Like I've, I've said it before, but that is not. It's not. Yeah, no, I, I agree. Like yeah. they're all I mean, strong mages. I mean, to be honest, like you know, one cast of wailing winds could just. Well, I yeah. mean, that's true. There and a lot of these are, are like really strong mages, right? Um, but. Yeah, I mean. But yes, it's not, it's not uh, forty-five and and uh, what we're seeing out of out of Marverni. Um, I want to fight. If, if oh, you start oh, like we got a model like the van here, then hold on. Wait, did I see him? Oh, this is the uh, the Vanheim monolith. Oh, okay. Who has a chest wound? Where? Please identify for me on the monolith where the chest is. Uh, the middle. You think it's here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And a, and a never healing wound, and he's doing something naturey. He cast howl. He's casting howl. He has a lot of gems though. Still. Resist magic. <laughs> and it's him versus the boars. Uh, I think the wolf yeah, are not going to do yeah. well. Well, I think they'll. What the boar's going to do against him, though? Oh, oh yeah, I mean, I think he's fine. I think, um, and I think the boars are probably going to catch the uh, the command. Oh, oh he what? was going home. Oh, uh, I don't know. so Which he way? he teleported in. At, was it ritual? No, he was the he was the defender there. I know, I know, but so he was just chilling in this random province with ritual returning on. I think I feel like he teleported into his own province. Yeah, in which case, why did he have the rich? Well, like, but like, why then have him to retreat? Right. And also, like, how all the rich returning isn't. A... It's not a combo. Because I think he would have won that. I I think he could have, yeah. But did not happen. But he didn't. So okay. Okay. So Vanheim and Bernie's the big Vanheim army is leaving. Bernie is on the throne, but this force can't beat this force, so it probably has to retreat. Yeah, it's just it's uh it's definitely not the quick war Vanheim is hoping for. It's not. Yeah, it just, like a, a just kind of, of shuffling. A bit of a slog, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Shuffle is as shuffle does. Um, Raiding has been, you know, pretty effectively shut down, though, so it's, it's mainly just down to the armies at this point. Yeah. Yeah, we're not really seeing uh, much. I mean, Vanheim lost a lot of raiding army, ra raiding stacks. I mean, I, I, yeah, I, th I think Marverni pretty convincingly won the raiding game. Yeah, Marverni did too, but Marvernis are just so replaceable. Yeah, it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't really matter if it's free spawn. Yeah. All right. Well, let's, I want, you know, I think we'll go ahead and call this one here, but I want to, want a battle. <laughs> I want to. the stick. Show me, tell me the thing. Show me the thing. Um, so we'll hope to see that one next time. I still think Hinnom is my current favorite to win. Um, I think I think Hinnom is increasingly my current favorite. But you know, I again, we might, you know, maybe we'll see. We could see a the, fish blitz. You know, the huge, the huge amount of melkarts we've seen at this phase. But... There's a lot of melkarts. Getting, getting that, um, that mercenary architect, yeah, is big. Now it's not a hit. Can, can get uh, uh, the blood citadel uh, through in seconds. Uh, wouldn't yeah, it, but then yeah. you have to stop. You have to demolish the fort. Stop production. Yeah, it's, it's true. You do, but and... it's doable. I mean, I demolished in uh, the Baratus game. I demolished my capital fort in the middle of a war. Yeah, yeah, it's it's worth doing. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's definitely great. I mean, we're so we're turn we're turn sixty six, and nobody looks that close to winning because I don't think Caleb is is getting there. Um, on a yeah, it, it, it actually feels like we're further from winning anyone winning than we. Yes, we have done in a long time. But so I, th you know what that means, right? 
What does that mean? It could mean we could get the Grigori out of Hina. Oh, I would. I'm down. I, I want to see them. I think we're going to see them. He's got I, he's got plus seven. We know that. And yep. His research yep. is going up a lot. I think I think we'll see them. I think we could see them. I am I am very sad in Dominion Six that they didn't get moved to Blood Eight because you have to now research them as their own. I, th spell. I think they should be a, a Blood Nine though. Like it's it's fitting. I, I, it, it, don't get me wrong. They're they're awesome, and so it makes sense of Blood Nine. But researching them as their own spell is is tough. Uh, I guess you just have to justify Blood Nine. I think over a lot of other choices to begin with. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Although, I mean, it's one of the main. As well, it's not one of the main reasons necessary, but it's one of it's one of the reasons you could want to play uh, Hino in the late game. So, true. All right. Well, I think we'll go ahead and call it there. Um, thank you for joining me. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Thanks everybody for watching, and we'll hope to see you all in the next one. Have a great day. See you, everyone.